The ionization of bases works the same way, and it also works the same way as ionization for um, uh, solutions, ions in solution. You can see again, and I'll shortcut the process by identifying that my sodium hydroxide pellets are solids, and therefore um, the solid will not participate in the reaction. So as we did before for the ionization, this will be the concentration of sodium ions multiplied by the concentration of OH minus ions. The general um, expression here when we're looking at the equilibrium constant is that the equilibrium constant can often um, have the subscript Kb, which is an indication that this is a base. Bases tend to accept hydrogen ions um, from acids and therefore um, sometimes we can use a general form in order to identify that as well. But for now, most of the bases that you will be encountering until we look at, at acids and bases in more detail in the next topic uh, will be of this kind of similar sort of form and therefore can be written uh, uh, as the product of the soluble ions. And that's the same sort of logic that we've used when we were looking at ions in solution previously. Uh, again, these ones are ones we can um, investigate a little bit more in the laboratory and hopefully you'll have the opportunity to do that. Thank you for watching.